Does Kamala Harris know what a tariff is? When Donald Trump was president, the European Union certainly knew what tariffs are. They used them to block American companies from exporting goods, automobiles, and food to Europe in order to protect the native local farmers and manufacturers of Europe. Kamala Harris was told that she would have a light, fluffy interview on MSNBC. But unfortunately, her interviewer actually asked her a question, a basic question, on policy, something any presidential candidate or president should expect to answer. Tariffs aren't unique to President Trump. President Biden has tariffs in place. He's actually looking to potentially implement more. Where do you come out on? Is there a good tariff, a bad tariff? Uh, well, part of it is you don't just throw around the idea of just tariffs across the board, and that's part of the problem with Donald Trump. I, frankly, I, I'm going to, and I say this in all sincerity, I, he's just not very serious about how he thinks about some of these issues. And one must be serious and have a plan. To so that's very bizarre. It sounded like Kamala Harris had no idea what her, the interviewer was asking her. She seemed actually pained. Look at her facial expression as her interviewer is speaking. Implement more. Where do you come out on? Is there a good tariff? A bad like, oh my God, I'm being asked a policy question. And Kamala Harris may, n may not know that most of the tariffs that Donald Trump had against countries like Europe were retained by President Joe Biden. That means Biden-Harris retained most of these tariffs to punish Europe for not doing free trade with us. So Kamala Harris does not have an answer to this question. Well, part of it is you don't just throw around the idea of just tariffs across the board, and that's... I don't think Kamala Harris is herself serious about being a president. Let's hear what Donald Trump says about tariffs when he was president. You know, for us, is a very unfair thing. But the worst part is Europe to us on trade is horrible. They don't take our farm products. They don't take our cars. I said to Angela Merkel, Angela, how many Chevrolets do you have in the middle of Germany? She said, none. I said, that's right. How many do you have in Munich? She said, none. I said, that's right. You know how many Mercedes Benzes, BMWs and Volkswagens? We have millions. I said, it's gonna have to change. Uh, they take advantage of us on trade, uh, not quite like China, but not that far off. This issue should concern every voter who shows up on November 5th of this year. Thank you.